Hi, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to use Pinterest to get more free traffic. So, the first thing you want to do is you want to take your general niche or category and then you want to break it down into 10 smaller categories. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Alright, so in this case I used uh, digital marketing. All right, and you got hosting, general projects, freelance, affiliate programs, affiliate marketing, uh, marketing software, email marketing, video creation, content marketing, and landing pages. And then from there, you want to add posts right, into each of these uh, pins. You know, <clears throat> so you want to go ahead and open this up and then add two per day right? two two or three because you don't want to appear spammy right? so two or three related um, post and you want to pin them in here to your board All right. so once you do that in the beginning you won't really see any results but roughly after these start getting halfway full you can go ahead and add your own content to each of these and over time uh, you'll start seeing that they get like they get posts they get pinned um, you know they get liked to get followed so over time you're gonna start seeing people you know uh, saving your your posts and your pins and you will get traffic that way so that's how you can get free residual traffic now, when I compare this to other free methods such as, I don't know, YouTube or using, let's see, maybe um, Quora, I, this is not really as strong in my opinion, right? but it doesn't require as much work either. So if you have the extra time, I would highly recommend that you go ahead and, and add your content and uh, try you know try for yourself to see how well it does for me it it's not as not as good as Cora Cora and YouTube is by far the um, really really good sources of traffic yeah you have to you know work for it by creating a video for YouTube or um, answering a question or a post but it's definitely worth it and uh, now getting back to you know, Pinterest yeah, the good side is you don't get as much traffic, nearly as much traffic in the beginning as Quora and YouTube, but it, it can build up over time and it doesn't take too much work, right? So you've already created the content, you know, you, you have some kind of thumbnail for your video, if it's a, especially if it's a video, you can just reuse it or modify it slightly and then, and then use it as a post. Uh, as you can see over here, this is, this is straight up uh, the thumbnail, right? This is just a this is just a thumbnail and that's it. There is no extra, you know, stuff that that this person needs to be needs to do. So this works well with YouTube videos, right? Because you already have the video uploaded, you already have it posted. Um, you don't have to create anything. All you have to do is just pin it, and you you know you kind of set and forget. And over time, as your your board gets more popular, you know you're gonna get more traffic. But it's it's a long it's, you're playing a long game with Pinterest, and that's that's all there is to it. Uh, the main key point to take away is to slowly, you know, um, first take your main topic or main niche and then divide it into ten smaller topics, and then from there slowly, slowly add uh, <laughs> pins to your board. Okay. And you do do that slowly because you don't want to get flagged for anything, right? And you don't want to get uh, appear spammy. So you know, three three in the morning, two at n two at night, or th you know, two in the morning, two at night uh, for pins per board is is okay. You know, per day. Right? So you're looking at anywhere between two to five a day is all right. And then you you just keep rotating it until. You uh, you have five or ten in each one, and then go ahead and add your your own content in there. I start adding once I get five. I start adding my own content in there, 
and uh yeah it, it gets traffic but like i said it's not don't expect it to be you know as good as the other forms of traffic i mentioned earlier and i just want to make sure your expectation is is properly managed uh, but at the same time you, you know if you're doing youtube videos you don't have to do much work it's just literally you know a couple of clicks and and your, your work is done so why not give it a try and if you found this information helpful I would really, really appreciate a like. Thank you very much, and I'll see you next time. This is Vince from Digital Nomad Institute signing off.